If you are a strict Catholic, a.k.a. a trad, read Dietrich von Hildebrand and St. Teresa Benedicta a Cruce and Jacques Maritain and or the living saint, Robert Cardinal Serra. If you are a moderate Catholic, a.k.a. conservative, a.k.a. communio, read Reginald Gary Lagrange and Father Chad Ripperger. And then both must read St. Augustine's City of God and Christopher Dawson, the two greatest historians that have formed the synthesis attempted in this present book. After this, the moderates must read Marcel Lefebvre, and the strict must read Joseph Rasser and Carol Wojtyla. Then an honest appraisal of Vatican II can happen. And that's what I, I'm currently trying to do myself. And then in the footnotes, we have all the bibliographical uh, references to all the different texts that you can read for all these different authors. So I'm currently trying to do this myself. I am currently reading The Mystery of Jesus by Marcel Lefebvre. This is one, his main spiritual work, it seems. Um, and then I'm reading uh, his, the main Summa, which is uh, They Have Uncrowned Him by Marcel Lefebvre. And then we've got Benedict, of course, this 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 uh, Ratzinger book that we're reading, Fowler. And then Theology of the Body, the actual text of Wojtyla. That's what I'm working on right now. We also have the the uh, the complete works of Wojtyla are being published by Seaway Press. Mm -hmm. And uh, I did a, a number of podcasts on the first one, Person and Act. And then the next one is the Lublin Lectures, where we're getting on into this as well. <clears throat> And so the challenge is, so this is what I'm doing in the next 10 to 20 years, trying to read all these sources <laughs> so I can test this hypothesis to see if I'm, see if I'm actually right about this. And then I'm going to write another book uh, trying to put this in. But th these two texts are, are very essential if you want to uh, mm -hmm. read Vatican II. The, the, I think these are the best print sources from Word on Fire. There's two volumes. This has all the texts of Vatican II, as well as commentary from all the popes and bishop baron and beside that we got to read all the encyclicals from before vatican ii <laughs> it's a lot of, it's a lot of work right. to do yeah the challenge quite is quite to go across the aisle to go across the aisle into the other camp and be mm -hmm. challenged by what they have to say and that's very difficult because it challenges intellectual pride it, it challenges us to think about it from their point of view what are they trying to say and that but i think that that is going to be what makes the difference in our own era that's that is my opinion right. that's my hypothesis that's the reason for this apostle